Listen, it's a movie that's going to be made here in the Virgin Islands. It's being made in the Virgin Islands. And I personally have been, you know, behind Ed and, and uh, David for years and years. He says 10 years. I can't believe it's been that long. Oh, yes. Talking about this, the concept of having a movie here in the Virgin Islands. So i let you give the history of, you know, your efforts over the years. Well, um, the whole thing started just before I came home where I, uh, I was still living in Oakland and I started having these visions for this movie. Mm -hmm. And it, it was really overwhelming how I would have these daydreams and dreams about this. And it's ironic because a big part of this, the main character has a lot of dreams. And, uh, and it's really funny, but uh, it was so indelible for me like I couldn't shake it and so I started writing the story the first version of it was you know not great um, <laughs> the, the always the first 10 pages were always pretty solid <laughs> you know? right. so I kept those for a long time and I kept tweaking that and I I would throw I, I must have written the, the story 20 plus times wow. um, and in the last couple years I've written it a good seven times um, and just constantly pouring over the story. What should this character be? Do we need this character? And who's the, I mean, it, it went all kinds of ways. Yeah. And, uh, but then um, I hooked up with David and, you know, it, it was always our mission. It became our mission real quick to see how we could build um, a movie industry in the Virgin Islands. Um, and that went along with the fact that, you know, I was really teaming to make this movie. Mm -hmm. um, and being that the film industry has always been something that the Virgin Islands wanted to um, sort of nurture or bring back and all those situations, um, it seemed like a good idea at the time. <laughs> but, <laughs> and you would think that it would be, uh, you know, like, people would be throwing things at you to make this happen. But that's not really the case. Um, but that's par for the course in independent filmmaking. It was what I had to go through with my other film. So it was nothing really new that it would be a challenge. And a challenge is like an understatement. Uh, so it's uh, we've gone through different things and tried different methods of getting the resources to make it. Um, until, and, and we really had to wait, really, that it was really like until it was the right time because the things sort of became available for us when it was time. Um, you know, we, we started this company, Cutting Edge Entertainment, with um, a few pieces of equipment. You know, when we did the Kamoi video, when right. we did JDPP and Spectrum Band, and then uh, one day, we, David and I were discussing how we're going to take this company to the right level that we need. Because we didn't really have what it really took to make a movie. Mm -hmm. um, and that same day, as we're talking, the previous owners for Gripflix, which is a big grip and electric company that pr uh, produces bigger pictures, they were uh, getting off their boat from Water Island. And I went to go talk to them, and they said, we're selling the company. <laughs> David. <laughs> um, OK, um, I can't tell you how much they were asking for, but it was a large amount that I didn't have. <laughs> but I still walked away from that meeting as if they gave me the company. I don't know what made me think <laughs> that we somehow we're going to yeah. make this. And I said, David, we got to get this money. We got to get this company. <laughs> we got to make this thing happen. And we were practically dancing out at um, Tickles, which is where we were. <laughs> and we were like, okay. And and we really believed in that this was this was for us. Right. And we we did it. I mean, it took a long time and it took a lot of a lot of doing, but we we made it happen. And that gave us the ability now that we can shoot things at the caliber that we we really needed to be to say we're making a feature film here in the Virgin Islands. Mm 